yeah hello guys in this video i'm going to be showing you how many sport betters lose a lot of money the reason why many sports betters lose a lot of money so that you can avoid this so if you don't want to lose more money on sport betting and you want to be making profit on sport betting you need to watch this video from beginning to the end because what i'm about to share in this video is something that you can't get it anywhere apart from this video and i'll take my time to go through all these things and i've done a lot of research about this that's what i want to share it with, with you these six things all boil to one thing so that is why many sport betters lose a lot of money and i'm going to be explaining everything so all what you need to do is that you need to listen to it and after that you go and execute it and it's going to help you a lot so the first thing that that cause many sport betters to lose a, lose a lot of money is that they don't have bankroll bankroll they don't have bankroll they don't have a specific money that they assign to betting they don't have a specific money that they, they assign that oh i'm going to be spending this amount of money this month on betting they just deposit any random amount and they are going to bet they don't have a specific amount that they bet and more to the point they don't have like each game I'm, go I'm going to be betting this amount on each game they don't have it that way immediately they if they deposit hundred dollars they are going to bet it on one game if they deposit two hundred dollars they are going to bet on another game that's it but a good spot better you should be able to have a bankroll that you follow let's say if i think that oh i want to spend hundred dollars in one month i want to spend hundred dollars in one month so I need to divide hundred dollars by thirty. That is one month. I need to divide hundred dollars by thirty. That is one month to get to get like the amount that I need to be placing per per day on a bet, so that I can be able to reach the thirty days without like me running out of money or so. So that is the power of bankroll. That is the power of bankroll. So and many sport better don't have this as i say so if you are having this as a sport better there is no way that you're not going to make a lot of money on sport betting but if you're not having a bankroll you're not having a specific amount that you spend on sport betting and you are just spending any random amount placing any random amount on your bet it's likely that you're going to be losing more than you win and even if you win let's say you win thousand dollars and you use the thousand dollars and go go and place all the thousand dollars on another game and you end up losing that particular game that means you run out of money and you need to deposit money again to continue your betting journey so the second thing that i will talk about is discipline like many sport betters they are not disciplined what did i mean by discipline they will say that oh i'm depositing this money to go and like bet on this particular game they will say that oh, i'm just depositing let's say i'm depositing 50 dollars to go and bet on this particular game but immediately they deposit the money they, they either go to add like one game to that particular game that they have already selected and they wanted to bet with that 50 dollars or they are going to divide the 50 dollars into two and use up save some amount and go and place um, aviator and other like e-games and use the remaining $25 to now place the game, which is not disciplined as a sport better. You're not disciplined when you are using that, those kind of like pattern, or when you're following those kind of pattern, it means that you're not disciplined. So the next way that I'll go, or the next thing that I'll go on to talk about when you are like when you are a sport better and you're not following this you're going to lose a lot of money it's strategy you're not having a specific strategy that is working perfectly well for you you're not having a specific strategy that is working perfectly well for you what did i mean by strategy that is working perfectly well for you let's say i can be good when it comes to over 1.5 goals but when you are better when you are also better over 1.5 goals like you find it difficult like you find it difficult to like being able to analyze the game and get a good over 1.5 goals games to bet on and you will also be good when it comes to like home win or away win or something of that kind or double chance so when you are having a specific strategy that you follow for a long period of time as a sport better th there's likelihood that you are going to like find out oh the place that you normally make errors and that end up like you lose more than you win and you correct it and you're going to you're going to make a lot of money when you are having a strategy when you are having a strategy 
that you follow has a sport better then you're going to make a lot of money on sport betting it's not like like you see somebody they pay somebody will be placing accumulator placing single games placing a lot of like different different options and they end up losing more than they win that's why they, you're not having a particular strategy that you follow and immediately you follow one strategy for a long period of time it's going to work perfectly well for you when you follow one particular strategy for a long period of time it's going to work perfectly well for you so the next the next like the next point that i'll talk about that led most sport better to lose a lot of money is that like they know they are not using the money line method they are not using the money line method what did i mean by money line method like they are not they don't always shop around or go around to check for other sport books to see the order they are offering for a particular game that they are going to bet they just go ahead and bet on either sport bet sport bet or sorry sporty bet or what expert if they are like they are using like one expert or sporty bet they just go ahead and bet on that particular game with like on that particular like game on the bookmaker's site without checking on other bookmakers side to check the odd and sometimes when you check the odd on let's say on one expert it can be higher than that of the one that is on sporty bet and when you are looking for that and you get a good edge then you can make a lot of profit out of that because let's say if you are like on sporty bet they are offering a particular game of one cd 90 pesos and on one expert they are offering that particular same game with two cd odd two cd odd you're going to be making a profit of 10 cent you're going to be making a profit of 10 cent per per game per game and i know many people will say 10 cent is not a big amount when you combine 10 cent by 100 that you realize that oh it's a big money or when you take it for a long period of time and you accumulate it you realize that it's a big money and that is why many sport bettors lose a lot of money on sport betting so the next and that is the final thing is excitement excitement that is why many sport bettors lose a lot of money and this one i can't stress anymore excitement immediately they win one game they are always excited that oh they have make it not knowing that oh it's just a edge for the bookmakers to spend all the money that they have won on that particular game let's say if somebody like you somebody just see two thousand dollars on his or her account or like he just plays a particular game and won that particular amount he become happy and so happy that oh i need to now place if he was placing 200 dollars i need to now place like thousand dollars on this particular game to get more return on that and they they always think oh that way that they are going to get big money in return faster but you are also putting yourself at risk of you losing more and when you win, win a game and you are very happy like you can make mistake out of that you can even go ahead and place all the game all the money on one particular game and without even knowing before you realize your money is gone so make sure you follow this particular like principles has a sport better if you want to make a lot of money on sport betting and if this video helps you and you want to be seeing videos like this make sure you like this video subscribe to the channel and turn on post notification bell very important turn on post notification bell and more to the point make sure you click on the link on this video description to join our whatsapp channel where we provide you with free live games we provide you with free live games that you can bet on to make money out of that and more to the point after you join you can also chat me there for your vip tips if you are interested in our vip tips as well so thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one peace out